school bus ridership is down during the pandemic. That's not surprising news, but proposing some cuts to make up revenue and patch up a $63 million budget hole. Hector Mejia is live in the Southwest Valley with what this could mean for passengers. Good morning to you, Hector. Hey there, Alex. Good morning. And RTC started operating their schedule on a cutback schedule, the Saturday schedule every day of the week. And if you haven't been on a bus lately, you'll notice once you board the bus, you'll say hi to the bus driver, Exit Glass Shield. And that not every is available. Some are blocked off to allow for more social distancing and the signage inside for that six feet of distance is pretty obvious. And RTC is now thinking about making more changes. It's proposing cutting four bus routes and making other adjustments including schedule changes. The specific routes that could be impacted are on RTC's website. And the agency is holding a virtual public meeting this afternoon from 1.30 to 3.30. They want to hear from their passengers. That's because RTC is facing a $63 million budget shortfall. And they tell us it was much higher than that at one point. With COVID, it was a $102 million deficit. We've actually proceeded to internal cuts where we were able to save $40 million, but we're still facing a $63 million uh, financial burden. COVID-19 is changing the face of transportation. Within the next six months, RTC plans to install technology designed to neutralize viruses and germs, not only in the air, but also on surfaces. That again, that uh, technology, they're hoping to uh, implement that in new buses within the next six months or so. And they are seeking input again from their passengers by August 28th on the proposals they have on the table to cut some service as they try to deal with a $63 million budget deficit. Reporting live in the Southwest, Hector Mejia, 8 News Now.